Hello and welcome to Python tutorial 3 on arithmetic operators. First, what is an operator? It is a construct that processes one or more data. In Python, an operator is represented by one or more special characters or a keyword. In Python, there are several arithmetic operators. We have operators for addition, subtraction, asterisk for multiplication, slash for division, two forward slashes for floor division or integer division, percent for remainder of integer division, and two asterisks for power. Now let us see these in action in Python. So I have written a script to show these examples in Python. Now I'm going to run it. So first we have addition. So five and five is 10. Now there are two types of numbers in Python, integer numbers and floats. Floats have a fractional part. Previously, we added the integers 5 and 5 and we can also add integers and floats together like 100.23 plus 1 is 101.23. Next is subtraction. First, integer subtraction. So 10 minus 2 is 8. We can also have float subtraction. For example, 20 minus 2.5 is 17.5. The float subtraction results in a float result. Next, we have multiplication. So we can multiply two integers. 5 into 5 is 25. We can also multiply floats. So 10.1, we can multiply using the asterisk operator by 3. And here, one strange thing you will notice is that the result is not 30.3 as you may expect but very close to 30.3 now why is this important it is important because if we write something like this in python we compare 10.1 into 3 is equal to 30.3 python gives false and this can lead to bugs in our scripts so in order to do a comparison, we can write something like 30.3 minus 10.1 into 3. If the difference is less than 0 0.001, so we can assume that these two numbers are the same. Now next, division. Division always results in a float. So if we divide 10 by 2, we get 5.0 which is a float result. 1 by 2 gives us 0 0.5, which is again a float result. We can also have integer division or floor division in Python. Now, floor division results in an integer and it is used with the operator, which is two forward slashes. So 10 by 2 is 5. And this 5 is an integer result. 10 by 3 is 3 because it ignores the remainder 1. In order to get the remainder, we can use a percent operator. So 10 percent 3 divides 10 by 3. So 3 is the integer result and 1 is the remainder. So percent operator gives us the remainder. Next. Let us look at the power operator. So 3 squared is 9 and 2 cubed is 8. And the power operator is 2 asterisk characters. Now there is something called operator precedence in Python. This means that certain operators are executed first. For example, multiplication is done before addition. So if we write something like 2 plus 2 
into 3 what happens is that 2 is multiplied by 3 first so that gives 6 then 2 and 6 are added which gives the result as 8 now if we want to change the order of operations we can do so by using parentheses so here we have grouped 2 plus 2 with parentheses so 2 is added to 2 first this gives 4 then 4 is multiplied by 3 which gives 12 so that is all in this tutorial and see you in the next tutorial